Hello everyone, Neon Chicklepuff here, and welcome back to the episode of Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we found Admiral Bobbery. We did his last request before he passed away, but he didn't pass away. Turns out he was he's just a really heavy sleeper. But now he's actually joined our party. Here he is. But I'm gonna take a little rest because I actually did a lot of uh, battling. Not really a lot, but I did a few um like off-camera battles and I got some coins and experience points, so now. I'm actually gonna go and rest because I lost a, a, like a little bit of HP and FP, so I'm gonna go rest and then just refuel and then we'll get back into the story. No problem at all. Because it was fun anyway. I like grinding. I should have been doing this for a long time. I would have been really overpowered, but then again, being like overpowered is not that fun in RPGs, even though it kind of is, but really it isn't. And I just realized those are underpants and a tank top as a flag. Okay then. I mean, it's. I, you know what? It's not really creative. It's cliche. It's, it's underpants. But anyway, Flavio, we're back. Uh, hey. Ah, it is Bobbery. Welcome back to you. Do you know how worried we were? My stomach has been most upset. But I must worry about everyone here. But who worries for Flavio? No one. Do you know how hard it is for me to just sit here in safety and worry so much? I do not know what is out there waiting to lurch and snack upon me. But we do not even know how to get home! For the sake, the blue brainy sea- Oh, I didn't get- I skipped that way too fast. Oops. But no more yelling! Now it is time to pull together and work as a team! Flovio, old boy, I must say, you talk rather too much. Such insolence! Grr! I growl at you like an angry jungle beast! I oughta- <coughs> Oh my god, sorry, I need to drink a water. So in any case, Mario, about that crystal star you spoke of earlier. There was a rather odd rock in the far east of the jungle, with a skull carved into it. So call it an old sea bomb's intuition, but that skull rock smells suspicious. Heh <laughs> heh! Oi, Bobbery, you wanna know what smells suspicious? Flavio Zombit! Oh, he smells like low tide! Wa ha 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 ha! But seriously. You may be on to something with that skull rock. I say that that's where the treasure is. Well, anyone could figure that out, you mutinous joker. I mean, how obvious. I was already saying in my head that the treasure is certainly behind that rock. And as such, I will continue the noble duty of protecting this camp from invasion. Captain Mario, carry on. I'm sorry to make so many requests, but you know. Flavio, you old cash grabber. If you want the treasure, why don't you go get it yourself? Oh, well, uh, yes, uh, Admiral. You see, I... You're a coward. Well, yes, you have a point. Let us decide this fair and square, shall we? Listen to me, everyone. Who thinks I should go along to investigate the Skull Rock? Oh, heck yes. Yeah, take it with you. F fun out there, jerk. Off with you. There you have it, Flavio. Fair and square. Eh, hey, what? Um, no, not fair. Flavio hates you all. Flavio will join you for a short time. Thank God it's only for a short time. I do not want this guy as a permanent party member, so don't worry, guys. I wasn't lying. Bobbery really is our final party member. We're not getting any more. Flavio's only a... He's only a temporary one, like the egg. And Bobbery was for a, for a small... I almost said for a few seconds. Yeah, it was for a few seconds, actually. Um, yeah, but guys, Flavio is going to be joining us for a little bit, but you want to see something really, really weird? When we ride on Dez, pause, um, look, yeah, this happens. Flavio rides on Mario's back, and Mario r rides on Dez's back. I know, it's, it's, it's weird. It's so weird, but this is how it happens. I guess there's no other way to put it. They could have made a riding animation for Flavio, but then having Flavio essentially riding Mario would look very, very weird in an E-rated game. So yeah, I can kind of see why they didn't do that. But anyway, let's get back to the Skull Rock and then, yeah, figure out get, where to get that treasure. And that's Crystal Star. So I'll see you guys back at the Skull Rock. I know, a lot of backtracking, but trust me, the backtracking ends here. Oh! Oh my God! Finally, a good bingo! What? What? How did I miss that? 
Maybe that's what Ms. Mouse was sniffing out then. I How did I even miss that? Okay then, Starpiece. All right, so now we're back at the Skull Rock, and now it's time to figure out what it is to do here. And Bobbery, since you're the sailor, you should probably know best, so let's see what this is. Ah, now what is all of this? A dead-end taunting Flavio, with its dead-endness. But, hmm, is this... I think this is the Skull Rock Blobbery bothered about. Well, it positively reeks of ancient secrets, yes? Let's plunge into this puzzle. Wait. Where are you going? A large stone blocks the way. It seems to carve the shape of a skull. Okay. There's a space in one of the eyes. Mario, old boy. I've got a gut feeling Flavio's gem might fit in that eye hole. Hmm. Flavio's gem. Oh, yeah, he was singing about that gem back at the pub. And he's singing the exact same song that we did before, so I'm, just, I'm not gonna... Three times red. Four times blue. Okay. Same song. But Flavio, we need something. What is it you ask of me? You want Flavio to lend you something? Is this correct? What could I have that you need with such anxiousness? Chocola Cola, coins. Wait, I want to see what he says for coins. What? You want me to lend you coins, you poor pauper? I must scoff at you. What on earth do you need coins for in a deserted island anyway? It's true. He has a good point. Think before you speak such foolish thing! Speak! Or think! Let's see, Chocola Cola. You ask too much, little man, except... Wait, I already gave it to you, you rat! Okay, that's kind of funny. But what we really need is Skull Gem. What? You want me to lend you the Skull Gem? You really, really need it. This is the hill room of the House of Flavio, you know. But I suppose it is alright, because I am Flavio, he of such ludicrous wealth. I'm just lending it though. Do not dare run up with it. Do not make me dock pay. Wait. What happens if we try to run? Wait. He's gonna Wait, what? He's gonna leave us with it if we try and run away? Wait a minute, what? Are you serious? We can actually run on with it. He won't say anything? Okay, that's weird. He... Okay, then. Whatever, Flavio. Anyway, let's put it in the eye hole. Skull gem. Three times red, four times blue. Wait. Wait, what? Oh! If we get it wrong, we have to fight enemies. Okay, I screwed things up, but hold on. Let's do this right this time. On the head. Wait, what? What? Wait a minute! I'm an idiot. There we go, I had to ground pound. It said, even said hit him on the head, okay. Ooh, what's happening? Oh! And then, there's, there's a bomb logo on there, so I assume we have to use our own bomb and then... Bobbery can go in and explode it, and he's back. Wait, oh, the gem. Oh, such excitement! The cave entrance! Hmm? Huh? What? Ah, uh, my skull gem! M mario what were you thinking? That gem was part of the house of Flavio! Calm down, it's right there, it's a gem. Woo! What a happy day! My skull gem came back! My jolliness has no end! I assume you're not gonna go with us, though, because it's a cave. Now then, I'm sure you're all disappointed, but Flavio must be heading back now. Oh no, please stay. I cannot let those back at the camp worry about me further. You two understand, yes? So, let me know if you find that glittery treasure, alright? Ah, <sighs> Flavio. But you know what? We're close to a level up anyway, so I'm not gonna heal, I'm not gonna do anything. We're gonna level up pretty quickly. Ooh. Month star, day circle question mark. S scoffing at danger, my brave explorers enter the cave. Oh, it's Flavio. Will they actually find the Pirate King's treasure? I tremble with ampu- Wait, anticipation. I'm said amputation. No, that's something completely different. Anticipation. Now let's save over here, because now we're in the cave. Which means that the treasure is somewhere here. Oh, speaking of treasure, Miss Mouse, we're going to need you. 
Is there anything in here? Yes, there is. Star piece? Isn't that behind this barrel? Ooh! Ruin powder. Handers all the right... Oh, so... Sorry, Courage Shell. I'm gonna... Sorry, Courage Shell. I'm gonna... I'm gonna get rid of this. She's gonna sniff out the Courage Shell. Yeah. Wait, what if I leave and come back? Then I want to see if there's anything else in this in this room. Because it's suspicious. Ooh. Okay. There's ghosts in here. Spoopy. All right, Mimit. All right, Miss Mouse. Mim -mim -mim -mim. Okay, anything down here? Oh, oh wait, there's a thing. We're safe. Okay, we can get back down. Anything? Nope, nothing. Let's just keep going then. Oh, another fire enemy. This is a new one because I know it's a recolor because you know we're getting into that part of the game where the um, the enemies become recolors now. And this is one of those things. Yeah, this is. A lava bubble. It's oh, it's just a traditional lava bubble from the Mario series. Okay. Wait a minute. He has an item. We can show off her new attack. The um, what's it called? Oh, we can't even. Wow. Well, that sucks. We can't do it. Next time. Don't worry, guys. I'll do it next time. So I don't have any FP. So yeah. And I would heal, but we're close to. Oh, like a level anyway, so yeah, there's no point in doing that just yet. One more battle though. Wait, we got it anyway. Power punch and ups your attack. Eh, I'm not gonna need it. I only want to do the attack anyway. Oh, wait, oh, oh, wait a minute. I saw that. Shine sprite just out of view. And wait, does it wait? I'll battle this guy. I'll battle him. And we left with 20 experience points. Wow. And we leveled up again. Is this the second level up this episode, or is it just the third one in the third episode? If so, then that's crazy. Now, you see, I would do HP, but I'm gonna do FP one more time. But there's a reason why I'm doing FP, and not FP, BP again and not HP. Because, wait, I'm gonna get these coins first, I'm gonna get the star piece. The reason why I did BP again is because we have a badge that allows us to give us more HP, so I figured, why not? There. 30 HP now. Perfect. But, ah, uh, you know what? We can go for a little bit longer. I was going to end it off here, but we can go... Whoa! We're going to need Vivian. This is, like, really, really stressful. Oh, <gasps> okay. I'm sorry. That's, that, that is just... It's just really stressful. Like, I hate that so much. Okay, anything else here? Oh, wait! New enemy... Oh, uh, new enemies. Bill... Wait, whoa. Bullet Bills! New enemies! And it's... dead. Okay, that's it! New enemy, Bullet Bills! One experience point. Okay then. Let me just change my party member. We get no coins for it. You struck first, okay. Okay then. Oh, and Bobbery's really weak! Oh crap, I gotta heal him! I thought, I thought he would heal, uh, like, automatically the level up, but he, he didn't. Alright, let's give him the super shroom. It was free anyway. Here you go, Bobbery. You! You! Whoa. Here we go. Here are the real new enemies. Bullet Bill Blasters. Oh, I believe that's, that's what they're called. I know. For some reason, in the Mario universe, the Bill Blasters have always been like referred to their own enemy. Like These things are monsters, apparently. But the bullet bills themselves are too. I don't know, it's weird. So cannons are classified as creatures in the Mario universe for some reason. I don't know why, but it is. And they're even in Smash Run on 3DS. So it's pretty weird, but anyway, okay, let's attack these guys. Uh, spin jump. And their HP, our defense is very, very high. Maybe, you know what? Can't be high enough for a bomb though. Yeah, they have really high HP, though. And they can spawn bullet bills, I forgot. Oh, God. You know what? Perfect opportunity. I'm gonna try... thing. Oh, I did it wrong! I wanted to try it out! Next time. Next time I will. I promise. I'll, I'll do it. I'm gonna do it right. Uh, 
Okay, oh god, oh god. Hey, excuse, excuse me! It's the X, of course it's the x knots. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Tornado jump. What? I'm starting not to like tornado jump. I might take it off. Okay, this battle's just not gonna end, is it? Yeah, body slam a cannon. Body slam the bannon cannon. Mannon, all that for a chicken nugget. Okay. That was way harder than it should have been. Pause. But you know what? I wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna end it off here because it's been recording for a little bit. So, as usual, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door. And if you guys enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, favorite, and comment. And question of the day is, um, why do you think bullet bills or though no, the blasters are considered creatures, like they're cannons? Why are cannons? considered creatures. I don't I really don't understand. I want to know what like what are your opinions on this? Like you personally, you watching this, whoever you are. Why like why like I don't understand. Do you understand? I don't. If you understand, then care to tell me cuz I don't know. I want to know. I I don't know. Why are bullets or no cannons classified as monsters? I don't get it. Well, anyway, that's it for the question of the day. And I'll see you guys in the next episode and as usual, I hope you all have a great day. See you later, guys.